see it play out in the polls again, people catastrophizing. I know Democrats a week ago were catastrophizing because Joe Biden in one poll was, what, 30, 36, 38 percent. Very interesting. There have been several polls since then showing that Joe Biden's doing A-OK. -okay. I haven't seen the media obsess over those polls. I mean, there's a, an economist poll, an economist YouGov poll that came out a couple of days ago. Look at that, Reverend Al. Joe Biden's job performance among registered voters, not adults, among registered voters, sitting at 50%. Now, I don't say this because I think right now Joe Biden's doing the best that he's ever done. I am right. I am showing this and the one we showed this past week, uh, last week, to say, okay, well, if this is an outlier, are you going to sit and talk about it for a week like everybody talked about the outlier on the ABC News Washington Post poll, which was an outlier? You look at this again. This is the latest national poll that we have out by, from The Economist. Very, very respected media organization. Has his approval among Registered voters at 50%. I, I just wonder again, are we going to have, because I'm still reading articles about last week's poll saying, uh, saying somebody should run because Joe Biden's sitting at 36%. Yeah, in one poll here, the most recent poll, he's at 50%. Will the media obsess over that over the next few weeks? Anyone that has been engaged in, in the political process for any amount of time, no, you can't take one poll and decide that you're going to call the, the race over anymore. In a boxing match, you take one round unless it's a knockout and say the fight is over. So clearly this is a long distance run. And Joe Biden couldn't have a better assist than the behavior of Donald Trump, who still yep. is the assumed opponent he will face. Uh, more and more every day, people are taking DeSantis less seriously. Uh, he's like a baby in a crib with a rattle wanting to be like daddy more than he looks like an adult that belongs in the living room sitting around having a discussion. I think it will come down to Biden and Trump unless something dramatically happens. And I think the more we see the tirades of Donald Trump on Mother's Day, no less, the more it reminds people, wait a minute, I don't want to go back there. And I think that that is yeah. uh, one of the assets that Joe Biden has, aside from some of his achievements as president. Right. And speaking of daddy issues, we'll be uh, reading Maureen Dowd's op-ed this weekend talking about Donald Trump's own daddy issues. Uh, and also talking about the fight being over, Jonathan Lemire, I suppose at some point over the next four hours, we will talk about one of the uglier weekends in Boston Red Sox history. Uh, but that time is not now. We